U.S. lawmaker has denounced Japan for denying its historical wrongdoings. Chairman of the U.S. House Foreign Affairs Committee Ed Royce made the comments before meeting with visiting Korean Vice Foreign Minister Cho Tae Yong on Wednesday. Now, Royce said it was important that Japan and others learn from history so as not to repeat the mistakes of the past. Well, he said that one of the most important lessons was to admit, re referencing Tokyo's recent review of the Kono Statement, which, of course, acknowledged the Japanese military had forced women into sexual servitude during World War II. Now, although the Japanese government upheld that statement, it claimed there was no evidence to support the claims of the former sex slaves. Cho said he appreciated Royce's support and that it sent a strong signal to those who are trying to rewrite history.